Hello YouTube, welcome back to like, uh, Learning Life and Be More Independent with Tommy Cam. I'm your host Tommy Cam, here to talk about what he has learned from the FAA today. This was coming from news about at, at 6 o'clock in the morning. But I was just tuning in right now from our four local news agencies. And, and they currently got, um, so they are, so right here, eight hours ago, Alex made flights all the way. All right, so, so they say when air traffic control officials realized that they had a computer issue late Tuesday, they came up with a plan, reboot the system, and at least desperate air travel Wednesday morning. Unfortunately, the plan, massive flight delays, and uncomfortable user to stop to all the party nationwide. This is information via from CNN Business, a source familiar with the Federal Aviation Ad Administration operations told CNN. FAA officials told reporters early Wednesday that the issues the well bit in a 3 p.m. hour on Tuesday. Officials unfortunately filed a main notice to the air missions or NOTAM, the source said. A corrupt file was also found on the backup system. The NOMA is a critical and a noted safety computer that address pilots of issues along their route and at their destination. It has a backup, which is official switch to when problems with the main system engaged according to the source. In the overnight hours of Tuesday to Wednesday, the FAA officially decides to shut down and reboot the main you know, TA system. A simple destination because the robot can take about 90 minutes according to the source. They decided to perform the reboot early Wednesday, button air traffic flying to the East Coast and minimize direction in flights. They thought be ahead of the rush the source said. During this process, the FAA reports that the system began to come back online, but they say it'll take time to resolve. The system, according to the source, all did come back up, but it was completely pushed out of the potential information that it needs for a safe flight. An approach taken longer to do that. That's when the FAA issued a nationwide ground stop at around 7.30 a.m. holy all the domestic departures aircraft in line to take off or hold before entering the runway. Plates already in the air were added verbally by the safety notices by the tr air traffic controllers who could stack electricity or paper record at their desk for audio notices. The Transportation Secretary Pete Bullinus or that after actions review said no district evidence or indication was the issue of the cyber attack. The source said norm system is aging effectively due to an overhaul because the burglary continues inflexible to the budget, the tech has been pushed off. 
the source said, I think they are going to find money to do that. The FAA addressed and then just break and more. The FAA did immediately respond to the scene and request for comment on this account. So, so that information right there, I would like to talk about a little bit, okay? The first information I understand of like what's going on. The FAA has got a breakdown and after that they hold all flights, okay? So then after that you guys got a second problem with people maybe missing their connections like on cruise ships, they're missing their connection like overseas, which I think which is really kind of awkward because with this norm, which I'm kind of understanding that this norm system is all too much information for one radio sector for people to even look at. So, So if we look at the general disclaimer, which is they got tracks, they got airport arrival, decimal board, they got route management tools. And to show you this, their system is looking at it right now. Their system they are still working on it right now, which I think which is really kind of interesting, okay? So, if we type in our look, Indiana, IND, and then click VTOM, there are... So, um, so they say on here, so they got, uh, so it's reading on here, the Fort Worth Airport, they got from San Antonio, Texas, temporary flight from ATC, all aircraft entering or existing must be through sort code assistance by the air traffic control, ATC facility. Aircraft must be sworn to the designated code at all times. In a TFR, all aircraft entering or existing TFR must remain in two-way radio traffic with ATC-4, Fort Riff Air ARTCC telephone number, I won't give that out. Plus like on here, they also got, going on down. So they got also on here, which I think, which is really kind of interesting. Player 102 self Special security notes will Disney World theme park. This known replace known of 9-4-9-8-5 to request Transportation Security Administration website update and additional information con concerning airspace waves, flight instruction, and this norm complying with strike material. Detail in Section 2, 352 of Public Law 1007 of issue by the Section 521 of the Public Law 100-199 published by the U.S. Constitution. The Federal Aviation Administration, FAA, clarifies that the airspace detect in the known national defense airspace any person when knowledge will, will follow, violate, violates the rules permitting an operation of in an airspace, may be subject to criminal penalties 
under 49 uh, 46397, pilots who in the airspace must follow procedures may be in fear to detain and interview by law enforcement security personnel promised to 14 CFR 99.7 special security instructions. All aircraft flight operations, flight controls, remote control aircraft are prohibited from three millimeters at the corners of Orlando 230 14.8 up to 3,000 uh, 3,000 AGL. So that right there was talking about 4 slash 3 dot 6 7. So they also, which I think, which is really kind of interesting on this, they got many different like communication. They got many different stuff on here. They also got in-to-know information for, like, all pilots. So, um, so my heart, my heart goes to anybody that has missed a connection flight. If you guys ever, and I mean ever want to look up any information, they got this website now called Pilot Web, which automatically shows you like where where things are, which I think which is really nice. They also got this aviation weather map, which I think which is really smart for like every airport because looking right now at um, at, at number 30, which is on our end, which they show on here, uh, they show that the meters are okay, looking around aircraft reports, they got a couple, 36, which is flight level 20. So that means they're 20 over the, the sky. And they also got a flight level is dirtation, so that means they are high up. So they also got, which I think, which is really interesting, they got like different measurements of like different stuff that you guys can follow on here, which I think, which is really, and I mean really important for like flight details. And, and if you guys would like information on this, I would love, I would love to give this more to you guys, like more information. So, so if you guys have have any questions, please con uh, please contact me by email. And if you guys have anything, and I mean anything that you guys would like like for me to talk about, you guys would like me to go over like the latest news and stuff, like on anything like on breaking news and stuff. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, ding that notification bell, because we will be back. Alright guys, that's it for today's video. Have a great day.